Let's compare numbers. What's the best way to compare the number of apples to the number of bananas? That's right, we can count them. Let's count these apples and bananas by placing them in two rows. One for the apples, the other for the bananas. One, two, two apples. There are two apples. One, two, two bananas. There are two bananas. Do we have more apples or bananas? Let's compare. One apple, one banana. Two apples, two bananas. There are two bananas and there are two apples. Two and two. The number of apples and bananas is the same. They're equal. Let's write the equal sign between them. Let's solve another problem. Do we have more apples or bananas? Let's count these apples and bananas by placing them in two rows. The top one for the apples, the bottom one for the bananas. How many apples do we have? One, two, two apples. There are two apples. How many bananas do we have? One, two, three. Three bananas. There are three bananas. Do we have more apples or bananas? Let's compare. One apple, one banana. Two apples, two bananas. Three bananas, but there are no more apples. Two apples is fewer than three bananas. We can show that with the less than sign. How many fewer apples are there? That's right, one. There is one fewer apple. And at the same time, the number of bananas is more than the number of apples. We can show this with the greater than sign. Doesn't this sign look like the mouth of a hungry crocodile that wants to eat as many things as possible? Now, let's figure out how many more bananas than apples there are. That's right! The answer here is also one. There is one more banana. Now you know how to compare numbers and use the less than and greater than signs. Let's continue our journey. If you like our educational videos, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Intellecto Kids.